Second Peter's, Second Peter's, chapter one, verse one. The KJV translation. The KJV translation. Simon Peter, his servant. Simon Peter, his servant, and an apostle to the of Yahweh Shah Amashiach. To them that have obtained like precious faith with us through the righteousness of Yahweh and our Savior, Yahweh Shah Mashiach. Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of Yahweh and our other one, Yahweh Shah Mashiach. According as he has according as his divine power has given unto us all things that pertain unto life and godliness through the knowledge of him that has called us to the glory and virtue. I love you all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh the Wadi Abashim El Shah for doing us the apostles and the elders of great millstone who deserve double honors, rightfully so. <clears throat> Shalom on to the Akim. Pushing the word in sincerity and truth and being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come. Race wars, family, concentration camps, the all five details, the market peace. 200 million missiles hitting the soil of America. Simultaneous in terms of Lord and the whole full life into the chambers. Simultaneous in the church of the Lord, shooting laser beams for the ungodly and the heathens, rightfully so. A Alvarez is out of the Lord, take the course of this video. Just a vessel seeking salvation out of this filthy place, spiritual on the Sodom and Gomorrah, Egypt, Babylon, and all the filthy customs they have taken upon. Oh, this, um, right now the time is 7 a.m. in the morning, um, Sunday, July 7th. 2024 the whole full year take this trouble and um to send out um peace and salutations to the whole full lot and um I had to get up I was exhausted I don't know for the last few days you know I was drained and um uh, I feel um I had to be, I had, you know I was you know watching videos and things like such um, so Apostles video, their street ministry, a couple other videos, it's going over, you know, you really got to watch stuff, to see what's going on in the world, you know, just, um, um, examining things and such, so, um, just sending out, um, greetings and salutations to the hopeful that, you know, um, we have been called into something so beautiful and precious that I was just saying this yesterday to someone. I said, what I do is to, and what I do, I can't give up for the world. I've been trying to think of a title. I've been trying to think of verses for that. But I'm just going to bring it all culminated together. You know? This thing of ours is, as um, our great apostle Gabal would say, this thing of ours is beyond, beyond measure. You know, and the word that stuck out in this video, I mean, these these verses was virtue. And and the headline reads for this is um for this for this chapter um, from Second Peter's down is growth and Christian virtue, right? It says, it says Christian, right? But we know it's a Mashiachites. It just makes more sense. If we stick to the Hebrew, all right, the anointed one servants, all right, are the ones, Yahweh Shah servants, okay, if we, if, we, if we know that what we've been contending for and we understand what this is truly about, we know that it's beyond what this world is offering, all right, I just saw a verse, I don't know about, um, where was that, Salakia. Oh yeah, it was in this chapter. I was just like, when I started, you know, the normal verse was Second Peter's chapter one, verse ten. But 
but I decided to start top and and I went to this word virtual, right? Let's see if it's still here. Yeah, all right. So just a bit. Oh, there you go. It says virtual. Virtue. Virtue, right. Um behavior showing high morals and standards. And that's what we do. We show high morals and standards and it's truth. We stand firm in this, man. Regardless of what's, what what the world is trying to distract us from and put in front of us, we know that you have a smell shot, it's the way out. You have a smell shot, it's the way out. And it's going to be revealed, and it's going to be revealed with, um, um, let's see, I got a verse that's on my mind. Let's see It's gonna go fast. I got a burnt out. I feel a little better. As soon as I started reading the scriptures, it's like my energy sources went up. You know, but uh, I was exhausted. The book says. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be glorious. But those that love us, oh, I got another verse. I want to forget that. I want I'm, the priest of the, the spirit of speeding. Okay. Uh, let's go. So much. Love is appearing. Very powerful verse right here if it pops up. Yep, that's right. It's the one. <clears throat> Alright. So um it, this was I truly believe that Yahweh Shah was sent sent his angels to give us the good apostles and the elders the message back then, now and and they've been doing it. And they back doing it again. Now there's another there's a few other verses jumping around, so Salah can bear with me. I'm just gonna go um with the spirit. Alright. It says right here, Revelation chapter one, verse seven. Behold, he come behold he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him. That's something powerful to say. Every eye will see even the ones that pierce them. That means there's something it's a go down, but there's something that's about to go down right now. And like I always say, you better always pray that you're on the right side of this judgment. Because all the years people always talk about um the rapture, the judgment, this, that, and all the but not got the don't have the full um understanding of it. The full logistics of it. They got they put they put their own twist on it. Where they don't have no humbleness, they they don't understand the precious blood, the precious faith. And people say, "Oh, why, why is God gonna be like that to her and leave everybody else?" Say he did it before. So y'all only people only want to read what they, you know, this other individual. He only reads what he want to read. But if you tell, oh, I believe, I believe when, when certain thing hits, he say, "Yeah, I believe in the old Testament part." There's no buts about it. It's the whole thing. Yeah, what Shah has given us everything. And he's coming back with a reward for those who are so diligently doing seeking him. Um, hold on, another verse. I'm gonna keep these tabs. Salakia, if I um, I end up bouncing around. Uh, let's see if I can find this one. I found it the other day. Do believe it's three. His reward is gonna be with him. And you better hope you're getting a reward, man. Some of you, man. Just so that you know. Come on. Here we go. All right. <clears throat> um, Revelation. I saw this. I just said this. Uh, it says Revelation chapter three. I think I just said this. In my mind. Uh, he the, Revelation chapter. 3 verse 5 He that overcometh the same shall be clothed in white raiment And I will not 
and I will not blot out his name out of the book of life. But I will confess his name before my father and before his angels. So that's something Yahweh Shah, this is in red, Yahweh Shah gonna do that to you. You know? He's gonna bless, he's gonna confess his name. His, your name in front of him. In front of Yahweh and the angels. And you're gonna be the one, man. You're gonna be one of those dudes. And this, oh, I wanted, I was trying to bring out this verse before at the camp. But this is real powerful because the brother said something and I was like, yep, that's the verse. Remember the same chapter, right? Revelation chapter 3, verse 12. He that overcometh will I make a pillar in the temple of my power. And he shall go, and he shall go and no more and, and, and he shall go no more out and I will write upon him the name of my power the name of my of the city of my power that's your how are you always in Jerusalem which is which is go right here which is New Jerusalem which cometh down out of heaven from my power and I will write upon him a new name and that's what we I'm telling you the Lord has started with the scriptures and this is what we need right now to, to navigate through this valley of shadow of death we need that man and that's what this world is going to find out when he comes back <coughs> when Yahweh comes back with the angels they up there talking right we just read that they up there Yahweh He's up there talking to um to Yahweh and the angel said, look, look at this one. Or or you know, Yahweh might be like whatever. Like, oh, alright, I go scope that one out and you go scope send the angel, go check out this one, check out this one, go he test this one. He need more, he need more, he need more, he he need to be more rooted. Whatever however it takes to get to the top, man. So whatever however however it takes to get behind those missiles. You better hope and pray that the Lord is carving you, shaping you up to, to be the one for him. You better hope you're a predestinated one. Because he's making us examples, man. Either for, for righteousness or for wickedness. For righteous judgment or right or wicked judgment. You better hope and pray, because the truth is about that too. Let's get that real quick. I love this chapter too, man. I'm gonna get this just a habit so I won't lose it. Hey man, this is what this this is. I'm right now. I feel much better because I was like really drained, you know, and um, you know maybe because it's hot, and I was doing running around trying, you know, trying to get ends meat and shekels, you know, just got just enough to get through the day for something to eat. I didn't even eat it. I just went to sleep. But after I do this video, uh, I'm gonna make me a little sandwich. You know. Um, like I said, you've been hoping pray that you're on the right side of this righteous of this judgment. Uh, righteous judgment. Um five. Because Yahweh all shot um he's coming back for those who, who are doing the um the, the will doing his will. Okay? It's another verse I wish I could find. Think of right now. It's, it's like it's lingering. But I want, I want to come back to this. If I make that the my ice in the cave with that one. Okay. So. Um, I had. Uh, Revelation chapter. Okay. We are. Um, Revelation. Let's read this again. If I didn't read it. Revelation chapter 1 verse 7. Behold. He cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him. That's something you better think about. Who the hell pierced him back then is back now. That he's got to deal with. He's they're already on the wrong side of the judgment. They're already on the wrong side of the judgment. Them two, even the even the ones that pierced him. And all here, this is the point here. I didn't get to this point. And all the kindred of the earth shall well because of him. Why are you gonna well because of him? Huh? 
Alright, what's this word right? Well, let's see. It says, um, well, right? Well. 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 A prolonged, high pitch cry of pain, grief, or anger. How? Oh, man. Give a cry of pain. Grief or anger. Oh, you know, no. They're gonna be like that, man. I'm telling you, man. You, you better hope and pray that. Oh shit, you're done. You're done, our Joshua. We know you're gonna be crying like a biatch. You're done. All right. And all the kindred of the earth shall well because of him. Even so, a month. So to wow. You're gonna be crying. And the, and the messages be warning you people of the Heavenly Father. Warn, the Lord, Yahweh said, warn them of me. And we've been warning you individual of him. <coughs> <coughs> so, he's coming back, man. Um, where was that? So, Go back here real quick. I just, I'm just um. Yeah, Revelation. Let's get a little bit in this chapter. This chapter is sticking out with the with the ultimateness. Um, it's going. See, these verses is made to comfort you, bro. You know. You know, people say, well, individual, I was surprised. You know, humility is, is um, no, um, pride is a motherfucker. But humility will cure that pride if you come humble and repent to Yahweh Shalom That's the, that's the facts right there. Alright. Um, what was that? Yeah, let's start back with this rap. Uh, what's going on? Yeah, I said that one. There was another one in the chapter. Yeah, he's coming back with a reward. Okay. things going on right here in this chapter it says Revelation chapter 3 verse 21 to him that overcometh will I grant to sit with me in my throne Ooh! even as I also overcame you got, you got some mission we got a mission man there's a mission that's been given to us bro oh man I was just saying that I just turned him a little one I said listen man this is what I gotta do man it's embedded in me man it's, it's, I don't know what that knows like how the world is just trying to con con contend with me. The world is contending with us, man. They battling against because they keep they had keep offering you shit. That's like it was offered to our our King Yahweh Shah Yahweh Shah cat came overcame when Satan was offering him all that shit in the world, bro. We know that verse, man. I ain't gonna get it now. Yahweh Shah was being offered the world all the shit that he made. And if we are with him, we're going to sit down with him after we overcome. Right? It says to him that overcometh will I grant to sit with me. This is how I was saying this right next to the words in red. To him that overcometh will I grant to sit with me in my throne. Even as I overcame. He overcame what? The, the, his time. Remember his, he said, um, um, the author of the finish of our faith 
Ooh, we out of here. We out of here. We out of here, bro. Them cherries and oh, um, them cherries gonna crack the sky, buddy. Yo, sign that up, sign that up, buddy. The heavens gonna open with the cherries flowing through them. I don't be knowing. And as I am sit down with my father in his throne, so we're gonna we're gonna be sitting with them, man. We're gonna be with the ones, man. Um, Lock in. We got a lot. Of, we got a mission. To, we got a lot of mission. We got a big mission to finish. Oh, there you go. Just saw it. What I want. Okay. Um. You know, I hold that one. I hold that one. Let's go back real quick. There was a lot going on right here. Um, because the very virtue stuck out. So we have morals and things to look forward to. We got things to look forward to. Great opportunity to um, to um, to govern. Cause we learning how to govern now. First we govern ourselves in righteousness, and then we learn how to use that same government. When we in the midst of these people, and they looking at it like, man, this guy right here different. And. We got that. We got that righteousness through Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Yahweh Shah. We have attained what is it? this precious faith. Let's read this again. It says, "Growth in our Mashiachites virtue. Growth in our Mashiachites growth." I like to put. I don't want to say Christians, but it's a Mashiachites. Uh, growth in Yahweh Shah servants. They say that. Growth in Yahweh Shah servants virtue. And we're gonna change. We're gonna um, we're gonna we're gonna put the uh, our apostles now is the ones that's doing this. See, then this is written for our learning. But our apostles are back, and and this book was for made for us, so we can say that our our apostles and our elders is is giving us greetings. That we obtain this precious faith, man. We can say that, man. That's true. You can see it, man. I was just watching the apostles. Every day, every every day the apostles put up a video. I'm I'm trying to follow suit. You know. I was able to get, you know, to um come down to down the brothers in New York and get a couple of videos in. You know. But you know, we all gotta walk in the life when we gotta go back to our work, do this, we gotta pay, pay, pay make ends meet, you know, try to pay out stink ass bills. You know, to, you know, most importantly, to do the will y'all watching y'all shop. Yep. Ooh. Lucky. So, it says, um, Second Peter chapter one verse one. Simon Peter, a servant. Simon Peter and the apostles today, the ones that's doing the will y'all watching y'all shop. You too. Are included in this. From Apostle Taha, Apostle Kabar, Apostle Carr, Apostle Ramla, the Elder Akim from Connecticut, the Akim from New York, across the globe, all the way across to um, London, Europe, all the way back to Canada. It's a big circle, so we're doing it. Texas brothers, let's name them out. Philly, um, DC, Baltimore. If I miss, you know, it's a lot there. We out there, man. If you the ones, man, if you truly believe, if you sincerely in the truth, man, you the one. Simon Peter and the rest of the righteous gang. So I can't. <laughs> Simon Peter and the rest of his righteous gang, a servant and an apostle, and, and the servant and apostle of Yahweh El Shah, Hamashiach. To them that have obtained like precious faith with us through the righteousness of Yahweh and our serve and our Savior Yahweh Shah Mashiach, grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the, through the knowledge of Yahweh and Yahweh Shah our other one, according as His divine power hath given unto us all things. With that pertain unto life, and that's the power of the scriptures. Okay, 
and godliness through the knowledge of him that have called us to glory and virtue. Who has called us to have morals, man. To walk in righteous conduct. Okay? And we're going to love his appearance. When he comes with my Yeah, let's read the next verse. Um, it says, verse 4, Whereby are we give, given unto us exceeding great and precious promise, that by these ye might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. And how? By, by having our um, morals, have a conduct. Brotherly love to each other. You know, watching by lead by watching the examples and leading by example. You know? So like you love the Lord please, but I, I got this other verse I wanted to um, bring out. I don't know if I read the other one. I just first just kept up in my mind. <laughs> okay, uh um this one here, right? So it says because um we have confidence in this, bro. I might be all over the place, Salakia, but these are verses that jumped out at me in my mind, and I just want to realize them because they came by. As I opened the tabs, I was able to keep them, so they, it was open to, for, for a reason for me to use them. We have confidence, all right? And we don't we don't have to see how about Shemel Shah to believe here that he exists. And I'm always talking to him. You know, sometimes I say, um, uh, this is what I say, okay? I'm having, I'm a, Foster Bar told me to have a man to man conversation with Foster with, 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 with um, yeah, Bar. Yeah, I'm shocked. So that's what I do. You know, sometimes I see, I tell myself, man, you got to get some body here, man. What, you know, you got to always, if you're going to let this happen, um, thank you. But, um, you know, just think, I be saying things sometimes. Like, yo, you make it happen. Sometimes I'll be so excited, or I'll be like, the day, I mean, it'll be like a day I'll probably be like a little gloomy. Or I'll be like, yo, man, hey. You king, man, you father king. I'm happy that you if we don't have you, we don't have nothing. We let these people keep moving on with this shit. Look at this crap. We let them keep doing all this, we ain't gonna have nothing. The earth gonna be gone. But you promised that the earth this is what Foster Hall told me to say. The boss said that if you have it, you said the earth gonna buy forever. So they not you, you said these things. Now how much of Rosh already said these things to us? We just gotta patiently wait. But I just you know, I'll be saying all types of stuff. You know, without no disrespect, but I'd be like, yo, you made it happen already, man. You might as well let it done, baby. Get it done, baby. Get it done, baby. Come on, baby. We out here for you, man. We rooting you on. We we rooting um, our y'all watch our power on. You know? And yeah, but I don't I don't want to I don't let I say I don't want to I want I want to endure. Now I want to go out, like I tell you, I was shot. Yeah, I was shot. They're gonna take, take me out. I want them to take me out because I'm worshiping you. you know, I want. I need that. I need that. That um. That pillar. I need to be, I need to be one of those pillars. You know. Let's try to get one in a little, little, bit, little bit right here. This right here, this stuff out to I love it. Um, I'm telling you, if you love his appearing, we out of here. Right? You up out of here. You up out of here, you're going to be the ones. Right, I'm just going to start with, um, so I get to the point. Because you don't want to be on the wrong side of these missiles, man. Shut the hell up. You talk all the shit you want. You better hope and pray that you're one of them, one of them predestinated ones. You're doing your work, you better do your work, you better do your work in sincerity and truth. Yep. Shut your damn trap hole and get to work. Um Second Corinthians chapter five verse seven. For we walk by faith, not by sight. We are confident, I say, and willing rather to be absent absent from the body and to be present with Yahweh Yahweh Shah out of one wherefore we labor that whether present or absent we may be acceptable of him accepted of him 
we want to be accepted of it. I'm present of it. We better be, we better be, we better, you know what, man? I, I want to, I want to, I want to, yeah, we want to be go lay down and, and get over it. Nah. But you know what the best part is? It's enduring. That's the best part. No matter what, you're going to appear in front of the judgment seat. So you better, you better get your priorities straight. Alright? It says, um, um, Second Corinthians chapter five verse ten. For we must all appear before the judgment seat of the Mashiach Yahushua, that everyone may receive the things done in his body. You see, it don't matter. If you go to spirit where you, you you've been you already judged. But if you're here in this body, you you, know, you better fucking get it your act together, boy. Okay, around. According to him according to according to that he has done, whether it be good or bad. And he's gonna appear, and you if you done bad, yo, look at look at the, there's a lot of people you can call out right now, but you know we ain't got time. You better get your priorities straight. I tell you how much my stuff gonna bust that cloud open, that cloud open, the, the sky open, and laser beam gonna be flying first. Laser beam first, then the turret will come through, zap, got that one, got gonna be zap the maze. Tell you. So you better open pray that you are um, alright. First, um, knowing verse eleven, knowing the terror of the Lord, we persuade men. So we out here, we persuade, but we are made manifest unto Yahweh through the tr trust. Also, are made manifest in your conscience. And you better, we do what we supposed to do. All right, we see the example, the great example. We see, ain't nobody got no lot of money. You know, we all we have, we can help each other. That's our ability, you know, when I, when I, shit, man, I'm, I'm always in this, now, hey, you know, um, I don't want to be watching our shop for the apostles and the elders to bring no stone. Let me say that. You know, what can you do? But do what you can for your, you know, get your, whatever you can get for yourself, get for yourself. You know, you got your bills, you, know, you can give to the community, um, to the, um, to the, um, What's the word? Right? To the congregation <coughs> of Yahweh Shiram Shop, you can do that. You know, work the charity, man. We need, you know, we need each other, man. Through the spirit of Yahweh Shiram Shop told us to take care of one another. You know, and don't be a goddamn crook. Don't be fucking Jake. Don't be, don't be, um, trying to supplant your own brother, robbing him. There's a lot of wicked people out here, bro. Don't be a baby Nate or a baby whoever. Alright? So when our king get back, he's gonna he's gonna um fix us, man. He's gonna fix us. I, I was just locked out. These words just jumped out of me and I was just all over the place. You know, I feel a little better though. Cause I woke up right out of time. It's 7.38 a.m. in the morning. I need, I need, um, <coughs> get one in. <coughs> so sloppy. You gotta keep fighting too. First, two, second Timothy chapter, second Timothy chapter four, verse seven. For I have fought a good fight. I have finished my course. I have kept the faith, and that's what you better do. <coughs> the ones you're gonna do it anyway, but I'm just giving you people out there fair warning, man. Don't be playing with this, man. You have a shot shiny plan, and you don't want them. You don't want you don't want to be judged on the wrong. You don't want me to run side of those missions, man. All those laser beams. Verse eight. Henceforth, there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord Yahweh Yahweh Yahusha, the righteous Yahweh Yahusha, the righteous Judge, should give me at that day, and not not to me only, but unto all them also that 
love is a parent. And he's gonna crack the sky open and he's gonna zap you fools. That's what he does. Yes it is. So Salakia, uh, all over the place, but those verses came to me. And uh, I like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yah Bashem El Shah Bashem Kakudas. The Wadi Yah Bashem El Shah for the apostles and the elders of the great millstone. Shout out to the Akim. Shout out.